Hi there! You're invited to listen to an exclusive excerpt from the next episode that I'll be publishing on Sunday. My next guest is absolutely fascinating and this is just a teaser of what you can expect from our discussion. Enjoy listening and I'll see you on Sunday for the full episode. Welcome to FinScale, a podcast created by Solen Niederkorn, shedding light on innovation in finance, banking and insurance. All about Aegean. Virginie Melen Christensen, Country Manager France for Aegean. It has something to do with the philosophy of our founder, because there are other companies in the Netherlands, but uh, our, our founders are really people-oriented. They wanted to create a, a company that is different, that disrupts the market, and it disrupts the market in all ways. It's not only on the, in the payment industry, but it's also the way we're working. To discuss this essential payment layer, I needed one of Adyen's long-term collaborators. The choice fell on Virginie, who joined Adyen six years ago before its IPO. We learn and laugh a lot with Virginie as we go behind the scenes of this Dutch-based fintech, which now has a worldwide presence in more than 20 countries and major partnerships with players like eBay. We find out how the scale-up transformed itself into a financial institution with a super agile entrepreneurial culture that allows it to quickly deploy new features and establish fundamental collaboration for its clients. Of course, we also discuss France, where Virginie recently joined as country manager, and how the European giant takes local specificities into account. This is an excellent example of exceptional scaling. Besides the fascinating corporate strategy, Virginie also shares humorous anecdotes, notably about Adrian's listing when she was in Asia. Enjoy the show! Hello, everyone. Hi, Virginie. Good morning, Sonny. With years of experience in the industry and a wealth of knowledge to share, I'm truly honored to have you join me on, on the show. Would you mind introducing yourself, please? Of course. My name is uh, Virginie Melen Christensen, and I'm the new country manager for ADN France. But what were you doing before ADN? Because you've, you've worked <laughs> in retail or yes. something completely different? Yes, uh, I'm actually a chartered accountant and I worked uh, for 20 years in London. And my last job in London was for Burberry, mm -hmm. where I was financial controller. And then I took on board a new project, which was payment related. And this is when I discovered the world of a payment and uh, implemented a solution for uh, in-store and e-com for mm -hmm. Burberry. And that's when I met Adyen. Mm -hmm. And uh, after doing that project, I decided that it was a very, very interesting uh, world. Yes. And that I would like to know a bit more about it. And that the solution to know a bit more about it was to move to one of the providers with uh, a PSP. And I did. So I left uh, London and I moved to Adyen six years ago in Amsterdam. Mm -hmm. I came uh, with uh, the family, I changed the job uh, for a company that uh, not a lot of people knew at the time. So really? people were really looking at me saying, you leaving Burberry for a company named what? And I was just <laughs> like, yeah, it's a company named Adyen. And uh, it's, uh, uh, I don't regret it at all. It's a very, very beautiful adventure. Uh, started six years ago and now I'm in uh, France uh, as the country manager. So You're new in that job. I'm new in that job. Yeah, I started the job uh, the 1st of March. Okay, congratulations. Thank you. Okay, so as you said, uh, Agile is not uh, known by everyone. I was discussing with a very good friend of mine who is an entrepreneur, and I said I was so excited to tell him that I was uh, receiving you as a guest on my podcast to talk about Agile. And he said, Agile, what is it? I said, come on, you don't know Agile. <laughs> so maybe that would make sense that we start talking about Agile. Um, and uh, what is interesting is that Agile's success can be attributed to many, many different things, the corporate culture, scalability, adaptability to market trends and uh, technological changes. Maybe we could just start and kick things off by asking what is Adyen in one minute? Adyen in one minute. So Adyen is a financial technology platform mm -hmm. and which offer end-to-end -end payment services to big enterprise but also to SMBs through uh, partnerships and to platform. Mm -hmm. We have uh, one unique solution. We build everything ourselves. And we have 27 offices everywhere in the world. And we went from zero employees to more than 3,000 employees today. And listed, you're next Amsterdam. 
Yes, we are listed in, uh, in Amsterdam. When, when did they start uh, listing Adyen? Three or four years ago. <laughs> <laughs> so what, what is interesting? I is remember. Actually, I don't remember the date, but yeah. I remember when it happened. Ah. Because at that time, I was in Hong Kong <laughs> with a merchant, yes. and we were around the table with uh, the treasurer of uh, that big international merchant, and he opened his iPad, and he went like, "Oh, I should have invested in Adyen." And I looked at him, see, "What are you talking about?" <laughs> because we were talking about a, a, a um, contract, and he was like. I, can, I am seeing the, the price of your share. You are just uh, listed. And uh, it was a big thing for, for all of us that we joined IDN as a non-listed company that suddenly we were listed. And so he told me, that's the time, when I was in Hong Kong, you just been listed and you were just, I should have invested. I'm like, oh yeah, and so I celebrated with the merchant <laughs> the, when uh, uh, IDN got listed. But it was, a, yeah, it was a very, very big uh, step for us. And all of us have started with, before being uh, listed as a small company that nobody knew. Mm -hmm. We were extremely proud that day. We still are, but very proud yeah, of Yeah, I can imagine. When we discussed last time, you told me that when you joined, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, uh, you were 200 employees. Uh, no, when I met at the end, it yes. was 200 uh, employees. So right. when I was still at Burberry looking for payment partners, there were about 300 employees. Yeah. When I joined, it was about 500. So in 2017, we were 500 plus uh, uh, employees. And now we are 3,000 plus. Wow. Cool. So maybe you can tell us about Adyen's growth history. And yeah, and what's interesting is that you saw it evolving from a pure payment platform as a broader fintech platform. How did it happen? We are a technology company. We always been tech people at heart. So it went very naturally, actually, because we are following what our merchants are looking for, the needs of our merchants. And we saw that more there was more needs in new features, in uh, more product, financial products that are not completely payments, but mm -hmm. they are still financial related, such as issuing cards, uh, uh, such as bank accounts, um, microcredit. But all this is actually to make life simple for a merchant and mm -hmm. to help them grow. Now that you've heard an excerpt from the upcoming episode on Sunday, make sure you stay tuned and connected so you don't miss a beat. Thank you.